Well, we're here today at the Go IT Challenge, and it's really a great partnership between UNSW and Tata Consultancy Services. The way TCS have set up Go IT Challenge is more than just a quiz. They invite schools in, uh, year eight students as teams, to come up with ideas for the use of technology to help their local community. Our project is a water chucking app that will raise awareness for water wastage. So we are from Victoria and basically our main goal and problem that we're trying to solve is homelessness. So when we go to the beach it's commonplace for us to see tourists who don't really know what they're doing and they put themselves in harm way because of this. We use technology by creating a website which we would then input into an interactive screen that would go along beaches in Australia. I'm amazed that these young people, boys and girls, at year eight can come up with the ideas that they do. Um, it's truly inspiring. So it's so great coming to UNSW because they get to see all the different engineering aspects and they can see what's possible because a lot of the times they don't actually get exposure to universities. It's amazing to see that like people our age have done these kinds of things and that we're here doing it as well. So this is, this is one event where we believe that the uh, young minds kind of get exposed to what a uh, career in STEM could be like through a very gamified kind of an event where they have fun whilst they also learn and understand very uh, you know, you know, basic uh, principles of STEM and how they can use science and how they can use technology to solve the existing and problems of tomorrow. I absolutely have great faith in the future generations. I really think at this age, when minds are still really fresh and impressionable in all the right ways, to be able to get kids stimulated around science and technology, the world around us, but more importantly, what we can do with it.